undumb. And he's fat. I want him in my fleet. All right, so let's go ahead. We're going to call this one the USS Gold. Let's see here. Frankie Treasure, US Bar A. US Bar A. A. And we're going to rename this. Oh, wait. First of all, cancel. Um, activate this one. Um, oh, geez. Yeah, there's no need to keep this one here. Uh, where is it? Where'd it go? Cool, there we go. Let's go ahead and discharge this ship. U.S.S. Gold. There we go. And we're going to name this. Gold. A. Name changed. All right. So let's go ahead and do a few things here. Um, oh, my inventory is totally full over there. Let's clean that out so I can get rid of some of the crap that is on these ships. All right. Let's go to the bank. See what I kind of want to keep here. This I want to keep, 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 keep. Keep this, keep this, keep this, keep this. Keep this. Oh, I, oh, that's cool. I got that as a reward, didn't I? Yeah. I'll throw this in here. Oh, what else? Uh, that can stay. Well, I might end up using this for a while. Um, so that's gonna. No, I'll keep that. Keep that. Um, don't care. I'll think about that. I'll think about that. No, 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 no. Um, go put this down here. This I might want to keep. Uh, this stuff I will want to get access, keep access to. Food. I like making dead trouble. I still have to find out if I can get rid of those. I might use this torpedo launcher. Uh, I might use these, this, those I can get rid of. Well, see, this is. Disruptor damage. This is disruptor phase phaser damage. Uh, I'll see what I have on my crew already. Um, so, yeah, put that over there. Don't want these things. So, yeah, I'll put this down here. All right. Let's bring up my character real quickly. I wonder if I can get this. Let's put this there. I'm going to discard this. And I'm going to go to the lithium store and see if I can get this. See here, reclaim. And this thing here, I'm going to hopefully buy this. So again, it's free. Hopefully I open up, it'll be a... Ah, it's 11. That's what I wanted. So, it's basically upgraded, and that's because I'm level 51. I believe it may upgrade again for free when I become level 60 or 65. All right. Um, so, again, the level at which you do things is also important. All right, what can I do here? So, oh, that's right. I want to get rid of the crap. Um... So, that was kind of cool. Well, at least it's not making my Vulcan dance. Alright, so I want to go... Let's see here. Oh, shit. So I need to get rid of all this crap that's on this ship. Because this is like useless crap. Not worth keeping. Alright. Alright. There. And what is this? Engineering console? So we're going to keep that stuff for now. More crap to get rid of. And it's much quicker to get rid of this stuff if you sell it and get nothing for it. Which is why I do this at the Starbase.
sell this, move on down, there we go. So I get a little for that, and a lot of these things I get nothing for. But this, just hitting the button is so much easier than saying discard, 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 discard. Alright, we keep on going here. And at least I'm watching my energy credits go up. That's pretty nice. Oh, sell. So I did gain like 84,000, I think it was, or 82,000 energy credits. Let's see here now. Go back here. I gotta do that just a little bit more. And get rid of the crap on this ship. So the question is, is there any other ships I want to gain access to for free? Um, this one, this item here, um, let's go to the Dilithium store real quickly. I think I can gain access to this one here. Let's buy that real quickly. It's, again, it's free, so I think it'll come as a higher level later on. But I really want to like see what's more powerful, the, that one or this one. Um, so again, um, this is one thing that confuses me. It says right now that it does the current one. 487 points and this one is f 975 so let's go ahead and stick that on there see that's weird now it's saying the current one now it's saying this one does 900 and 94 damage. Let's look at this. Okay. Yeah, okay, we're gonna put this one in there. Get rid of that. Alright, so these are prepped to build. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it yet. Um and they're all but one of them a level up ship. So so that's level up, that's a level up. So this, you uh, getting this ability here is important because it's another ability you can do, you can have access to. This one I may upgrade, I don't know yet. Um, but these are all tactical ships. They're not, well sorry, no. This is, this is a, ta uh, no, this is a cruiser ship. This is tactical or a um, assault ship basically. So let's go over here real quickly. What other ships can I just get for free that um, are worth it right now? So, categories. I'm sticking with cruisers, science. Um, I don't know what I want to do with science right now. So let's go ahead, go to... Again, I could get one of these ships here. Um, one of the Admiralty ships uh, is a possibility. Um, oh, I do need to get this, though. I'll show you guys why later. So I'm just gonna, I'm gonna dismiss it, though. So we'll rename this to the bad. Bad one just because it's a reminder to get rid of that later on and it's a simpler name so enterprise f i'm not going to get right now um but a lot of these ships is like do i want to i want to get later on when i can get the fleet modules um what's this This is a cruiser class ship. Ford beams. Wait a minute. Oh no, this is a uh, commander ship. Hmm, all these ships. Oh, but these ships actually have. Where was it? I just saw. Alright, so this one. Intelligence officer, that's right. 
And so these ships, oh, that's right. Okay, so these ships all have, oh. So they all have, what is this? Um, temporal spots. But the, like this is a more powerful version of that. Tempo cruiser, temporal cruiser, what's the difference? Okay. Hmm. Thing is, I would rather use this design. Um, that's tempting. Okay. So, ah, uh, it was a waste. Oh, no, that's right. So, where is it? Bundles. Starship bundles. So this is the bundle being sold right now. I kind of want this because it gives me the, this ship and this ship. And Klingon ships too. But those are the only ships I really care about. Um, blockade runner. Where... Ah, that's right. So I don't have that. that right. So temporal things and these ships. So these have all those ships that I'm really thinking about. And like, yeah. Hmm. Gosh, I don't know what to do right now. Um. Oh, I don't know what to do. Um, because I can get another, uh, what is it, commander, I'm oh, sorry, uh, at rear admiral ship if I really wanted to, and use that for a while. Um, it's like I don't want to waste my level up until I can get things first. Um, Alright, that's, that's what I'm going to do. Alright guys, I have decided... All right, so the U.S. is bad. The reason why I got this was because of this console here. It does have a free upgrade here. It's free, but I already have... Let's see, where is it? This ship is already free here. So what I'm going to do is grab the console off of this and stick this right here. All right, and we're going to discharge the U.S. is bad. USS Bad One. Nope. Okay. So, let's get rid of the crap real quickly. Keep that for now. Discard this because I have to. And this because they represent Star Trek toilet paper and I hate toilet paper. Alright. Go back over here to my man ships. I don't want to mess with this ship right now. I don't know what I'm going to do with it. But I do like putting cannons on this ship. Um, what I do want to do... Is take this ship, what, all these ships. No, no, that ship's fine. That ship. And that ship. So let's go ahead. Let's start with this ship. And what do I want to do? I want to put saucer separation on there, and I'm going to put this thing on there. I think this represents anti-matter matter spread. How do I get anti-matter spread? Right, no. What is this? Oh no, it's all, okay, it didn't uh, recognize it all. So I got all three of these set things in one thing. So that's that's good, that's what I want. Um, I'm half tempted to put science, one of these in science, because I want good defense. I don't know what I'm gonna do with that, but I'm gonna ready this ship real well. 
yet we're gonna ready the ship so now that is in my inventory and let's go fix this ship by fix I mean dude I don't want to fly around the ship of the galaxy with a ship looking like that kind of crap jeez no come on here we want galaxy class that's the ship we all love and adore and I do mean adore so with that um, interior original medium no let's go ahead what do I want the interior to look like um, triumphant battle triumphant classic we'll give this kind of look future we want classic um, I do like that too that's more from the movies actually we're gonna do that okay with that what do we want to do here no cost there apply changes and we're good now our ship doesn't look like a piece of crap and yes I define traditional as not being a piece of crap and if we're gonna do that we gotta do that this too so let's ready to this ship real quickly and let's see here oh that's what I will look for and we're going to customize this ship oh look they already knew what I wanted good for them all right, the question is what do we want the interior to look like? So this used to be the original interior, I think it was. Original, yeah. And then they changed it up and gave this current one to make a new one because this was really kind of sucky. Really sucky. Um, so... I'm going to give this this interior... And apply changes. All right, let's go over here. Oh, gotta love that uniform, guys. He's not a Vulcan, but he looks good. All right, and see here, that looks good the way it is. We want you. All right, and. Ready ship. Customize. Now this isn't like too bad because again, this wasn't the most popular. I mean, it was all, only saw seen a few times. But let's be honest. We want we want the original real look. That's what we want. And for the interior. Mm. Let's see here. I want to use something I haven't used yet. Um, I don't want to use that yet. Don't want to use that yet. I don't want to do on oh, yeah, I didn't want to use that though. Um We'll use this one. Same thing as the other one but different colors. Alright, let's go ahead and apply this one. Alright. Let's go ahead and ready. We're gonna ready this ship because I think this is to be the funnest one to show you guys right now. So we're ready this ship right now. And then I will have to go and search for the proper weapons for this ship. All right.
No. 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 Hey guys, okay, so what I've done is I've gone to my other characters and collected a whole bunch of gear for um, the ships that I'm going to be building that are Vice Admiral level. So, I got a whole bunch of crap prepped for that. And to be honest with you, I can still use some of this uh, level 10 stuff. Uh, because again, a level 12 is more powerful than a level 10 will be. If I notice here, blue. No, that might actually be the same now that I think about 35 phasers. Let's see here. 35, it's 11, yeah. So, and then, yeah, so they're, they're, they're actually the same thing. So, uh, there are some aspects, some, some parts where, like, a level, I think in weapons, you'll do more damage for, like, a level 12 or something than you would, uh, like, a level 11, even if it's a blue item or something. They've changed a lot. Some, yeah, it's hard to tell what they've changed. But that's, let's, let's go ahead and work on these ships right now. So, in the beginning, in level 50 through 65, I'm not trying to make the best weaponry right away because I, I, I want to be mapping out the ships. I don't know what I'm going to be doing and with each and every one of them. And they're going to be leveling up. And then under L, you'll find all these episodes that actually have really great equipment you're going to put in there. And I don't want to waste my time with certain things. I want to find one build, one ship, see if I like it, test it out. And so one of the episodes I did, but I'm going to redo at a higher level. And the video had some, uh, that I did the first time, ha I had some background noises that I noticed over there. Uh, let me find it. Uh, it's in the Dyson Sphere. So both the step between the stars and surface tension I'm redoing because of like this background noise. So I'm wondering if it's in the new videos and they did it so you can't record the video so I'm gonna test it out but let's go ahead and just show you the replay of this here and I'm gonna press that and come down here alright so now I have this uh, uh, deflector dish here that is really good it's purple it's level 12 it's something I can level up it has great hull capacity I actually want that because of my, my points are in engineering and I've increased my hull capacity that's gonna make me really strong there the ship, my, my ships at least. Um, it does do exotic particle damage and it does drain, but if I want to, I mean, I'm not going to use exotic particles. Well, no, actually I might use it if I'm in a, a science vessel. I will do that later on. Um, but for draining shields. But I mean, they, you got great drain there as well. But let's go ahead. Here's another great impulse engine uh, that goes with this set and another great shield. And I, a lot of the shields have, let me see here, this, this one actually has uh, 50% absorption and 5%, sorry, 5% absorption, 5% bleed through. Some of them, it's really great. They have a 10% uh, uh, bleed through. It depends on what shield you get. But I mean, there are these great items out there. Uh, so I'm gonna go through my missions and try to grab the items I want. Um, I've actually played certain missions over and over again to grab uh, like, four five fourteen of one item i do it while watching star trek um and you'll find that level they're level 12 and so then i'll level them up so i'm not wasting uh resources basically so again these early levels yeah not very important this is another item i want to get it's part of a set it's for a ship that's doing uh both phaser and disruptor damage and radiation damage is, is great too photonic photonic projector um projectiles a photon and projectiles of photon torpedoes. I'm not doing much with photon torpedoes, so I, well, I may not get this during this uh, in the, with this character. Now that I think about it, but I'm gonna have to come back through here. I might get the other trait I didn't get last time. Uh, but going through other episodes, you're gonna find. Let's see here, let's go through here. Admiral right Tuvok has requested that you meet um, Voyager in the Solarin system. All right, so here's a blue. He uh, your with a uh, I want something issue. better than that. Wow, so, yeah. really, especially when you get to level 65, look back in the missions. Some of those missions might have items you want. So, let's go ahead and just build up uh, one or two of these ships right now. I got items to do that with. Um, I'm not entirely sure all the weapons that certain races use, so I keep extra shields on, on my uh, craft. 
just so just in case I want to exchange it during mission to give me more protection for my ship. So let's go ahead and exit there. Let's work on this ship. <sighs> and right now I'm stuck between this one and this one. This one has a level up. And I may have to exchange this for a ship later on that has a higher level as I gain more materials. But this could be kind of fun to do. This one, I don't know if I'm going to upgrade it. Um, but I, I do want to work on a level up. So let's bring out my items here. And plasma, I only got three. What is over here? Three. Um... So I think for this ship right now, plasma kind of bothers me sometimes. I'm going to make this a plasma ship. And I'm going to put these plasma turrets right here. Um, these are plasma cannons, I should say. The turrets are right here. And I got these from... What was it? Another character? Um, I think they're... Yeah, they're bound to account. So... Um, these were brand new items that I got that I've been holding for like years. Um, but they're all 11s, so they're not 12s, but I will increase these weapons and get better things later on. Um, I don't feel like it's the best thing to have the best thing right away. I mean, absolute best. Why spend all that? Work your way up to it. You know, don't have to have the best all the time. So again, if we're doing plasma, I still need another one of these plasma things. I only had three... Um, I could I could probably get another one, but I'll do that later because I might also want to add a special equipment here. Um, let's go ahead and move on to this ship. And I'm thinking about putting these here. I have turrets here, so these are destructor turrets, and this is also a destructor turret, all, turret, although it looks different. It's one of the new styles, I think, from the Disgrace 3 series, um, and I don't have anything else beyond, I don't have an extra turret, so it's not the best thing. I'm going to throw this here as well. It's just reusing an item, as you can see, and I'm reusing these as well from another, another account. And I don't remember what this particular item does. Let's see here, it's a, a torpedo point defense system. So I think it's defending against torpedoes. Um, time six per target. Okay, so really great, I think, if I'm going against the Borg, um, if this is a tor torpedo, because they have those these uh, plasma tor torpedoes. That just freaking suck. They're slow, but they suck. Um, so we'll get back to this ship. Uh, let's go ahead and let's move to another ship. Uh, so this is the this is the ship. I think I'm gonna st I kind of start out with a little bit. I want to have more fun with it. I'd love to throw some phasers on there um, and make it all phasers. But again, I'm gonna collect items later, and so I like to use what I have. So I'm going to throw these uh, green Tetrion uh, dual beams in front of me um, and put them here. I have this one phaser beam here. I'm going to put that there as well. Again, those are dual beams, and I'm going to have a little problem turning a ship because it's a cruiser. However, I'm going to keep the saucer separation, which allows me to separate my saucer section from my dri star drive section and my other abilities. So it's not going to be too awfully bad. Um, these are going to be beam, beam weapons. I'm putting, uh, what was it, Polaron beams back here and plasma beams over here. Again, these plasmas I'm reusing, Polaron. Uh, yeah, so uh, the other thing... So, because I'm doing this, I want to make my weapons stronger. Um, I'm not going to necessarily see here. I want, I think for this ship, I'm not really going for much. Uh, I'm going to put this unique console up here. And I'm going to increase the beam strength of all my beams by 18% with one of, with these. So these are blue. They'll give me a, a more damage at least. 
Um, and these missions aren't as tough as, as some things are. Uh, let's see here. Uh, I kind of would love to put Tetra. I have this Tetron thing that I designed another character. Um, it is a 360 degree target arc. arc. However, it does less damage, but we're going to save that for later. Let's look at some of my other ships. So, again, I had more of these things up here. Um, we'll throw that out there right now. Uh, what does this thing give me right now? This is a deflector dish that would give me plus 24 to drain and uh, 35 to control. Um, drain or control, I really don't want that. I want control right now because I think I'm gonna want things to stop shooting at me is, is my goal. So I'm gonna stick this on. And again, I'm reusing that from another thing. And I'm probably going to put a drain console here to drain uh, the uh, uh, target shields so I can destroy it real quickly with my dual beams. And one thing you'll notice, and well, I'll point this out later. All right, so I have these other tactical consoles uh, uh, that are, again, they're green 12s. So they do 26.26. And so I need the right weapon for that. What the crap is that? So note, <laughs> a lot of people have things they want to test out, they will. Uh, so these Tetrion can uh, Tetrion, was it Tetrion? Yep, yep, Tetrion. Uh, and uh, Polaron, I need to get the white we right weapons for that. I do have these cannons that I did think that I might add. So I was thinking at one point that I would add. So on a ship like this, basically I would put Two Tetrion cans here, two beams here, um, but I'm not going to do that. Um, I, I, I'm gonna, I might do that later on. Uh, again, I reuse things. I look for the right items. I play the missions to get the right items. But let's go ahead and work on another part of this. Let's go over here and get, again, as I play through the game, I'm going to gain more items. I don't want to spend more than I actually have. So and I have more dual, uh, so more beams up here, and I'm gonna get more, and I'm gonna talk about that in a second. In fact, actually, let's talk about that 